Hey guys, Cole from Vision Miner here. I'm gonna make this real simple. We got a big part. I'm gonna see how quickly I can actually capture all this data. So we actually did some prep work. I got ASAP in the more sensitive areas and I put markers down. I also have scanner pyramids on the corners of the desk. So, you know, when I'm down here trying to get crazier angles, it still has something to reference. Now, the other thing I want to address is that this is in, quote, low mode, okay? So it's, it's the accuracy of the points it's collecting is gonna be exactly the same as if it were at uh, 0.05, but we're gonna be able to collect data very quickly with the same amount of accuracy and it won't tax the computer as much. There's only one thing to do, I'll just show you. All right, preview, I know it sees the markers. Let's start collecting data just like that. So here's a good example. Look, I'm not gonna have enough markers if I head down here. Boom. But if I tilt it so that, get up here, it sees the marker on the table. That's gonna need more markers, but let's just keep collecting data. Boom. Look at that. You know what we can do? Check this out. That little area, lots of little nooks and crannies. I'm gonna pause it real quick. Spray it with a little bit of the ASA. It'll pick up everything in there. Watch this. Bang. Look at that. That's how the A-sub works. Any of these difficult areas, spray a little bit, pick up the data. It's magic. It's magic in a can right there. You can get this at visionminer.com. This stuff has been a game changer in terms of scanning. Any difficult areas, for instance, this right in there. Just get all of it. Now let's pick up that data. So we got issues here. I mean, that's pretty much the bumper right there. Yeah, so what we'll have to do is clean up some of it, get rid of the table below it. But um, yeah, let's do a little cleanup right now, maybe. Let's do a little bit of my magic trick, this. Um, connected domain. There's the bumper right there. Invert, get rid of all that crash. We got some bumper right there. Now we can go back in, you know, and, and, and clean up any areas we missed out on. But for the most part, it'll take care of itself when we can uh, do some corrections. We're gonna get an excellent result out of this that needs to be cleaned up a little bit, of course. <laughs> Guys, you saw how easy it was to capture this entire bumper, especially with the help of the A-sub for those difficult to reach areas, with the A-sub dots, the retro reflective markers, which are crucial. That was fast and the results were good. It needs to be cleaned up a little bit, but all scans are gonna to need to be cleaned up a little bit. Maybe we'll show you some footage of that and how I actually get you know, the final result. But for the most part, that was quick, that was easy, and it was accurate. I can't explain how easy it is to do this when you combine high quality markers like the A-sub retro reflective dots, as well as the A-sub. This is going back on my car today. And in the morning, all of this A-sub will be gone. In fact, by the time I get home, maybe. So, and I'll leave nothing behind. I don't even need to wash my car. I love this stuff. You can pick up a sub on visionminer.com. Um, call us, ask us questions if you have them. But yeah, so that's what it looks like. We're gonna eventually do an entire car, but I wanted to just show you that you can do something like this quickly and accurately. So thank you guys for watching. Check out our website, visionminer.com. Um, write me fan mail. If you guys like this, maybe you guys can design me an app like a sweet body kit that I'll print out and put on my car. It'll be sweet. Actually, please do that. That'd be cool because I lost the bottom half of my bumper. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Subscribe for more.